This kind of workshop is very important for um, the LIFE project because we are starting this project this year, so it's the beginning of the project and we are in the middle of the preparatory actions. So this means uh, it will be very important to guarantee that the project runs smoothly uh, and uh, we'll, we'll meet a lot of experts and we learn from the experience of the organizations and this expert and it will be very important for us to implement our actions, our concrete actions later. Yeah, yesterday was very interesting. We had a very great presentation and I think that uh, we, um, we saw a, a lot of work already done uh, on other countries and for our project, the Safe Line for Birds, it would be very great to have uh, those results uh, to implement our actions and I saw that all the people are very involved in the thematic and the topic of uh, biodiversity and power lines. So um, I think it will be a good, a great opportunity for the future to be part in the network of experts on this topic. Uh, and I know that um, all the people here don't know each other and it will be great for the future uh, to exchange and to have better actions to, to protect birds. Well, uh, here the workshop only involved uh, NGOs, so it's great because it's more technical issues, but the, the issues of biodiversity and power lines, and power lines is not only for NGOs, but also for uh, TSO and DSO, so we will have to involve them in the, um, in the discussion, so it's primordial and essential. But um, we, we talked about this yesterday and I think it would be great uh, to have um, involved as well the policy members um, and uh, the, the ministers, something like that, because they can do something about um, about this thematic and we know that we will face this uh, for a long time so um, we need to involve all of them. <laughs>